Today we are going to do a workout from another book in the library called Fusion Workouts. And this uh, book combines workouts from yoga, Pilates, and bar. So we are going to do a workout today that combines yoga and Pilates. So um, you just need a mat or carpeted surface. I'm not wearing shoes. If you're comfortable with that, you can go barefoot. All right, we're going to start on our mat and do a child's pose. So we're going to come sit back on our heels. All right, little girl. And you reach, put your forehead down, and breathe. stance, go around your spine, and then flatten, and then go past flat to that sway back. Round, up, and down. Two more. Round up, and down, last time. We're going to place, we're going to come up, place one foot in front, and then reach back, hold, and then forward. So this will stretch your hip flexor, you can't see because it's my back leg, and then this stretches your hamstring. And we're just going to flow through. that foot back, other foot forward. Move forward and back. And forward and back. One more time. Okay, next we're going to do a plank. So Liz, you need to scoot you, scoot you down that way. Okay, thank you. To a plank. Legs up more. I'm just going to hold for a few breaths here. Breathe in and out. In and out. Breathe in and out. Now come up into a downward dog. So you're going to lift your seat to the ceiling, bring your head with your arms. Two big steps in. I'm going to face the front now. Push those arms up into a mountain pose. Then forward fold. This should feel good. Dog here in the pants. This should feel good up the back of your leg. Just let your head hang. spine, mid back, and upper back. Roll those shoulders back and down. All right, we're going to do some standing work with squats. So feet are right under your hips. You can reach your arms straight ahead. Sit back into a squat. I'll turn to the side for a second. And up. And up. Four more. And up. Three. And up. Last time. As you come up, raise your arms overhead. We're going to sit back into chair pose. Turn to the side.
and stand up. We're going to come into a lunge. We're going to send your left leg back. Bend both knees. I'll turn this side again to show you. Bend both knees so they make right angles. Okay. We're going to stay with this, your right leg front, left leg back. Raise those arms overhead. For crescent lunge. And then send the arms front and back. We're going to do a reverse warrior. So place your hand on that thigh and then just lean back. Forward, put your arm on your thigh for side angle. And bring it through. Send your right leg back into lunge. Raise those arms up for the crescent lunge. the same arm as leg front and back. So the arms are doing the same thing the legs are. Reverse that warrior. So hand to that back thigh. Lift up. And come forward with that hand on the thigh or that forearm on the thigh. Reach that back arm up. Side angle. We're going to do some balancing here. Lift your left leg. See if you can balance. You're going to take that leg out to the side. Tip over. Reach those arms out and see if you can balance. Other side. Lift that knee up. Tip, reach that leg, see if you can balance. All right, we're going to come down to mat work. So I'm going to face my mat, bend over, and reach my arms out. Hello. All right, we're going to do a plank again. Let me turn you. There we go. We have to share. All right, lift one leg up, the other leg up, pull your belly button in. Hold for a few breaths here. We're going to lift one leg now. Lift and lower. Now, if you need to, come down to all fours. Lift and lower. Last time with each side. I'm going to do push-ups now. Just Load. five times. Come down and up. Come down and well, up. Um, that's where you Four um, and five. forearm down, reach our legs long. Now if we need to, bend that bottom leg, lift those hips up and reach. Looking up from the side of the waist. 
surely not. No, it's probably going to be the four, batch program. Three, two, it is. and uh, one come down. Other side. Reach those legs along. I don't know if you hear, but my husband is on a business call right now. I think he knows I'm in here doing this. Pretty much I just need the camera on Kind of like we do the same option. Seven camera, and eight come down. Alright, come back to all fours. I'm gonna lift one leg and the opposite hand. No, it would not be a And lift it up. Oh, it would not be a Now, if you're good here, you can stay here. If you want more challenge, you're gonna move. Your arm and leg out in opposite directions. And bring it down. Other leg up. Reach. No, no, this is just. And opposite. There's just one before. That's a challenge. All right, come all the way down. Okay, just go a little more that way. <laughs> All right. We're going to place our arms down. We're going to place our head on our arms. And we're going to lift lower. Two more. Last one. Okay, relax your upper body now. We're going to lift, oops, and lower. Lift oh, yeah. and lower. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Lift those legs and lower. So not only that. Two more. Uh, some of their clients are going to Last time and now. Now then. All right. Uh, yeah, they leave it. We're going to come to a seated position now. And do some half roll back. So if we need to, we're going to hold on to the thighs. If not, we're going to reach our arms forward. Round back. Yeah, Round back. Lift up. Could be bad for a lot. Round back. Lift up. Two more times. Round back. Pull that belly button towards the spine. Lift up. And last time. And up. We're going to okay, piece it. Really so this so means we're going to not round our spine. Um, we're going to come back then I, then I'm just with a slanted so spine. Then, we can lift our legs uh, and reach our arms. Very good. I appreciate it. And I'll uh, need prod later. Oh, okay. Alright, bring your feet down, place your hands next to your hips, reach those legs long, and we're going to lift up in oh, reverse oh, plank. Oh, you don't have a QA. Three more. Yeah, I don't plan on running any Actually, actually, yeah. Last time, and down, we're going to come on our side now for a side leg lift. So that bottom leg can be bent, top leg long, it's lift. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Come to the other side. Oh, your code word for today for today's class is relaxation. And down. Okay, we're going to come all the way down on our spine. We're going to bring one leg in for a hug. And down from the other leg in for a hug. Yeah, 
All right, we're going to come into a shoulder bridge, trying to keep the seat up as we lift one leg up, bring it down, other leg up, bring it down, leg up, bring it down. Last time each side, lift it up. Bring it down. Last time, lift it up and bring it down. Lower the seat all the way down. All right, now we're going to stretch. Bringing that right leg in. If you want to, lengthen out the other leg to stretch more. And other side. Hug that leg in. And then lift both legs up to a tabletop position and just let them fall to one side. Bring those legs up and through and over to the other side. Bring those legs up to center and down. We're going to lift one leg up. Now, we need to keep the leg as straight as we can to get the stretch. So if you need to grab a band or something, uh, a tie, a yoga band um, to help hold the leg to keep it straight, um, you can do that. just as long as the leg is straight behind the knee. Because you can tell, just take that straightness out behind the knee, and you can tell you just take, totally take that stretch out. If you want more stretch, lengthen that leg along the floor or along the dog. All right. Bring that leg down, other leg up. If you want more stretch, lengthen that leg out. and hold. All right, we're going to end up here with a figure four stretch. So you've got your foot on the floor. You're going to take the other leg and cross it above the knee on the lower thigh. You want to have a right angle with that ankle. You don't just want to let it relax. You have that right angle and then lift up the other foot right hand of that ankle as well. Sometimes I like to take this supporting leg and tip it off to the side and really intensify that stretch. And bring it down, other side, so ankle across, flex that ankle. like this fusion workout of some yoga and Pilates mixed together. And don't forget your code word relaxation. And I'll see you next week.